Minecraft. In today's video, I will take you through how to edit a Minecraft video using Premiere Pro, consisting of three things, smooth zooms, adding cool subtitles, and for the ones that stick till the end, how to green screen Minecraft clips. Even if you are a beginner, you can easily follow along. Bruh. So let's get straight into it. Starting off with smooth zooms. Step one, drag in the clip you want to edit, just like that. Step two, search for transform in effects. Drag and drop that onto your clip. Step three, place the slider on where you want your zoom to start. Scroll down to the transform section in effects controls and click the timer icon on both position and scale to keyframe it. Step 4. Move the slider to where you want the zoom to end, preferably 2 or 3 frames, for that smooth motion blur to really stand out. Step 5. Now this is important. Uncheck Use Compositions Shutter Angle. After doing so, set the shutter angle to 360. This is what is going to take the zoom from being a boring old zoom to a smooth zoom. And guess what? There it is. Moving on to good looking subtitles. Step 1. Select the text tool and place it on your video. Step 2. Type in what you are saying in the video, select the text and use the effect controls to set your font, text color and for that added flair, even a stroke which adds an outline to your subtitles. Step 3. Select the middle and center align options so your text is always centered. Step 4. Set the text in your timeline to start when you say what's on it, it and end when you stop saying it. Perfect. But now this won't be smooth, it will just be text appearing and disappearing which is boring. Let's change that easily by doing step 5. Place your cursor at the first frame of your text. Set the scale to maybe 19 my guess. Go 3-4 frames ahead and set it to 110. Go 2 frames forward and set it to 100. Now if you play the video, you would see that it has a nice yeah, man, popping I'm effect, which is really more pleasing than plain text. Now I know this might seem like a lot, but the good thing is you only have to do this once. Just hold alt and drag your text to duplicate it. Edit the text to what you say next and so on for your video. See why I told you to select centering earlier? Makes life way easier for you. Before we move on to green screening, I would like to remind you that I'm a pretty small YouTube at the moment and that I really put a lot of effort into my videos. So liking and subscribing would mean a lot to me. Thank you. And now to green screening. Although you can try to remove background from any clip, it is quite hard and time consuming. So I recommend you record your green screen clip separately in a place you build with a plain background. I personally use a white and finite room that is built using sea lanterns and maps. But you could even use basic wool blocks or clay, as long as the color of it does not clash with your skin or whatever you are recording. After you have recorded your clips, drag them into Premiere Pro. Step 1. Search for the effect ultra key and drag it onto your video. Step 2. In effects controls, scroll down to the ultra key section, select the eyedropper near key color and select the color you want to remove from your video. Step 3. That's literally it, but if you want to take this to another level, select drop shadow from effects, drag it onto your green screen video and adjust your shadow from effect controls to your liking. This would really bring out your video clip and make it look more realistic. That's about it. If this video was helpful, please feel free to leave a like and I have a ton more effects that I would love to teach you, so make sure to subscribe. If you do run into any problems though, you could always ask me on my Discord server, link in the description below. Until the next time, I'll see you around.